I had two parcels at my door and I didn't want to wait until I was better to open them because when you don't feel good you want good things and two good things landed on my door. Good morning, afternoon and evening depending what time you're watching. It's me, Savvy, and today I have two boxes but I'm actually just going to open one in this video and then I'll make another video for my second one. So in this video we are opening a parcel from Cauldron Crate. Now this is a UK uh, subscription company? Question mark? So yeah it's a UK company uh, they at the moment they're doing the seven horcruxes so I've actually ordered to start my subscription with them I miss it on the first horcrux which was the di diary I think so the second one is the ring so I actually have ordered that and it will be coming my way hopefully soon but I am an impatient lass so I ordered a past box from them. It's a mystery one so I actually have no idea what box it is but I'm excited to find out what I will be getting in this box. I don't know if it's like a mix from old boxes or if it's a, just a complete previous box. I haven't actually seen enough of Cauldron Crate to know what to expect really. I just saw the diary one and I was just like oh my god how did I miss one of the Horcruxes? <laughs> So, yeah, I'm going to be opening this. It's okay. So, we may as well just um, jump on in. Uh, no need to keep my impatient mind waiting. I see pink. Is it pink? Yeah, I see pink. You can't see anything. Sorry. It's a surprise. Oh, wow. And then, look, there's some squigglies. Squiggles? Some squigglies? Some purple squiggies and some packages. Ooh, oh, now it's sticking to my dressing gown. Dressing gowns are not practical. They are good for one thing and one thing only, being cosy. Everything else is just trying to stick to my dressing gown. <laughs> okay, let's get some squigglies out of the way. See, now I have a squiggly. Okay, do you want a squiggly panther? Not even, not even bothered. Okay, I have a little, um, scroll, which kind of just, I think, by looking on the inside, it just looks like it's parchment paper. And I would be right, it is blank parchment paper. So there's two pieces of paper there. in a scroll like shape tied with twine holy wow there's like a whole lot of squigglies sorry if I like pause weirdly while I'm talking or like have a weird face it's probably me holding back a sneeze <laughs> there's something soft in here Ooh, a t-shirt Okay, let's have a look. After all to the well-organized mind, death is but the next great adventure by Albus. This is huge. I really need to change my um, clothing size because this <laughs> is bigger than my one from Geek Gear. <laughs> this is huge. So I thought UK sizing was smaller, but obviously it isn't, so I'm going to have to change that. I think I've already submitted my size for the ring Horcrux, so hopefully there's no shirt in there. Otherwise it's going to be a dress, because this is like dress size. It is touching my knees. But yeah, it's a little Dumbledore quote there. 
Um, will I wear it? Yeah, probably. Would I buy it in a shop if I saw it? No. But because I have it, I will wear it. And it will be a bed shirt because it's humongous. I can't believe. I can't believe how massive that is. Alrighty, let's look at something else. There's like something with tape on it. Oh, I like the tape. And then there's this flat thing. And then there's a. And then there's. Ooh. Okay, we'll just look at this one, shall we? I like that it's all like tied up with twine. Twine? Is that what people call it? Although there's like this little thing and then there's this thing and 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 what one do I look at first? I'll look at the one that I'm untwining. Untwining. What a untwining. <gasps> oh. So when I ordered this, right? Oh no, I feel a sneeze. <sighs> and I'm back. I kind of just sat there for a minute while my battery was charging and deliberated whether I should finish the video because I am really just tired. <laughs> tired and sick but I will power through because the thing that I pulled out before my camera died is really 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 cool and now that I've seen it I kind of want to inspect it but I didn't oh that's right I was telling you guys that so when I ordered this they had this little question before you complete your purchase and it asks if there's anything in particular that you want. Now obviously I had a nosy at their shop because I loved their diary crate and I was like oh they have some really really cool stuff in there I wonder what other stuff they have. So I had a little nosy and I saw something and I was like oh my god that is gorgeous I have to have it. And I kind of wasn't sure whether to just buy it so that I knew that I was definitely going to get it or to leave them a note. So I was like, took the risk, left a note and was like, please can I have this item? And they gave it to me. So that's really exciting. Means that they read my note. I'm going to show you now. It's this. <laughs> Look how beautiful that is. I'm actually going to pull it out of its little off of its card because this is um, actually a proper pen not pen um, fountain tip so you actually need ink to write with this how pretty is that oh look I lost a nail and you guys get to see that, aren't you lucky? I'm actually getting my, I'm supposed to be getting my nails done today. Oh look, and there's the other one. But uh, <laughs> I haven't quite gotten there yet. So I'm sorry about that. That does look really bad. But uh, yeah, look at that. That's so gorgeous. So super, super excited about that. That is so cool. I used to have ink and I don't have it ink anymore so I'm going to have to get some. I will have to get some. Oh I didn't I didn't um didn't bring my wand out to have it for my magical box. And swish <laughs> I got my wand now. Oh, now I can be magical, but I didn't need it to open my box. It opened all by itself. Because I'm that... That good of a witch, I don't need a wand to cast magic. Just kidding. This is my wand that I got from Geek Gear. And I decided that it was made 
for me. It is exactly the design that I would have on my one, so I really like it. I'll just show it. You've probably, if you've seen my other videos, you've probably already seen it, but it's got really pretty swirls. It's wonky, 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 and has a gem on the end. But I'm going to pretend it's a clear quartz. Anyway, one is out. Now I can just wait, whack it around, you know, poke an eye out or something. Oh, it's so pretty. Okay. So let's have a look at this little, I wonder if this is spare um, fountain tips, I think it is actually, by the feels of that I think it's spare fountain tips. Yeah, it's four, four spare tips, except they're all different, oh no there's five of them, they're all different um, mil, mils, measurements, they're all different ones so depending on what type of calligraphy you are writing you can use the different sized ones whether it be a title or a paragraph you choose what size you want I wonder how easy that is to change oh very easy okay good to know good to know alrighty very very good that is beautiful um, we have a Hufflepuff thing Hufflepuff Hufflepuff. Hufflepuff is my house. In case that wasn't clear. This is so soft. What is it for? Okay, so I have this Harry Potter book. Let's see. This is a very small book though. Like, this is tiny. If this is a book sleeve, it is only for tiny books. Because this is the Philosopher's Stone. And it doesn't even want to go in there. And it's a tiny book. So is it a book sleeve? I don't know. It's really soft. I want like a long sleeve shirt that's this material. That feels so nice. So. <laughs> let's have a look what else we have in here. There's this little brown package. Which I'm going to save for last. Because I'm feeling pretty interested about it. Oh there's another Hufflepuff thing. A little iron on patch for Hufflepuff. The Deathly Hallows in a little um, badger in there. Little iron on thingamajiggy. What's gonna call it? Which I will probably, I'm thinking I'm gonna make a blanket and put all the patches I accumulate onto it because I now have two. Which isn't quite blanket size but I expect the collection to grow. Okay, and there's this one. Which are bookmarks of whom? I don't know. What is this? Oh, more squigglies. Oh my. <laughs> the suspense. You'll never know what it is. This is a Muggle Born Registration Commission Administrative Registration Department issued by Mom. M O M. I guess I shouldn't say Mom. It's Ministry of Magic. They have declared I am a half blood. But a half blood, that's pretty cool. I always knew I had magic in me. Straight from the womb. I didn't, so that's creepy. Okay. <laughs> we have this little tiny box that they want to open. A origami box that they've made to hold what I think is ink. Is it? I think it is. A little. Oh, wait, there's a sign. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> ink. 
so they've given me my own little ink so now I don't have to get any they've done a really good job of making sure it didn't go everywhere they made the little box I like the paper look at that paper it is so cool oh no you can't look at it anymore and then they wrapped it in the brown paper and then they had plastic around here and we've got our little ink I'm afraid to pull it off just in case I get ink everywhere it's really full I was expecting it to be like half full maybe <laughs> if I was lucky but no that's really full nice so now I've got ink to go with my my quill oh it's so pretty as well I can't I'm so glad I got this so bad. It's just, I just really, really, really like it. Okay, I have a bag. I was starting to open it without telling you. Because I'm rude like that. Ba -bow. It's just paper. <laughs> I got you. Okay. <laughs> oh no, I'm losing it. Ooh, pretty. I'm pretty sure this was in the diary box. It's so pretty. Look at it. I am going to put that on my shelf. I have very limited space, by the way. I have a... Can you hear the rain? I wonder. Okay, I'm really dragging this out. I'm on to my last item. It has washi tape on there. The washi tape has actually fallen off. As you can see, they've taped it because the washi tape wasn't holding it. But it's got... Um, Salazar Slytherin? The face that the basilisk comes out of, the journal and the tooth of the basilisk and our basilisk there. So that's some diary themed uh, washi tape. I wonder if it's tape that they had from the um, previous box. What's in here? Oh! Oh! I... By the shape of it, I thought it was going to be a candle, but it actually isn't. It's a mug. <laughs> I was not expecting that. It is, um, I can't see it. Harry and Ron playing wizard's chest whilst Hermione is watching, and there's a Christmas tree. And then on this side, there is the hall. Oh, you can't really see it with that glare. Oh my gosh. The hall, like the four tables and a big Christmas tree at the front. And then on this side is Ron and Harry opening presents. And they're in their jumpers from Mrs. Weasley. And uh, yeah, there's their little presents there. This is, this is snazzy. Oh my gosh, I'm going to sneeze. So yeah, that is a cute little mug. It's, a, it's like a, makes me think of like hot cocoa around... Uh, a bonfire kind of a mug like it's not massive it, it feels like it's tin I think but it's really really cool better than a candle so we had a shirt with a Dumbledore quote on it we had these bookmarks that I have no idea who they are but they are Cauldron Crate exclusive so you can only get them from Cauldron Kate 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 hmm good beautiful I can speak words that's great doing well today um, I got my patch I got my Hufflepuff no idea what it is so I need to look up cauldron crate and f cauldron crate did I say it right oh, I said it right I'm gonna look it up and find out what it is if it is a book sleeve then I obviously read books that are too big and we had the quill we had the nibs for the fountain pen we had the ink ink 
we had this mug, we had parchment paper, we had the oh, crystal, I rock stone, so you guys can see, and my registration, and my registration, and I think that is everything. I did it. So now let me know what you loved the most from my box. Also, do not let me know how terrible I sounded in this and how annoying my snuffles were. So let me know what you liked and let me know if you Thank you.